Welcome everybody back to High on Life. It is time to get to the next bounty, which it looks like I think we only have two left. Uh, so I guess, no, technically three. I don't know why I said two, but we have Dr. Giblets and then we have two unknowns as well. And then I honestly think that is it, ladies and gentlemen. 2,000 for this one as well. Here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. We're a team of guns. Do you really think we need more firepower? Trust me, we need yes, this. Yes, all the firepower. The details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. You found another Gatlian? That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. John Giblets. <laughs> shit on him. I don't even know where he is. So, question is, how do we find him? We do it the old-fashioned way and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to search Blim City. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Me too. Need more if you do my job. Chill out, Gene. We appreciate you, man, and we'll handle this. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Oh. What? Detective mode activated. Pseudo again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Oh, sure. Give us detective mode now. This would have been useful earlier. All right. Let's well, what is detective mode? Day. Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Yeah. Got it. That is correct. That? Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately. And no matches found. Oh, <laughs> well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? And two and two makes four. Let's do what the suit says, kid. Uh, that didn't help at all. Okay. Let's go talk to Blim residents and conduct a full investigation. Let's see what we can figure out here. What's the plan? plan is just to interrogate people. I'm sorry, can we ask you some questions? Do you know a Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. Why do you look so nervous? Am I what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets? I don't oh, think it's this person. And I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. That can make you sick? You must know I ate 15 whole sandwiches. I, I don't understand why you're eating so many sandwiches. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is, but good luck. Okay, I don't think this person is and has anything to do with this. Do I look nervous? Jeez, you're making me nervous with this interrogation. Okay. Well, they didn't know anything. That was a real D rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Can I interrogate you, you? Yeah, you slick. Tell us what you know about Dr. Giblets. Slick? What the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. I don't know, and I don't give a shit. I'm busy. Okay. I don't think this person knows anything as well. Fucking ties of the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have any ties to the G3? Okay. Ooh, this bummer. person doesn't know anything. But they were telling the truth. Hey, listen, to uh, if you find a drum anywhere, my buddy Globo here, you know, he'd really love one. He's great. He's a good drummer. And I think it would help him. You know, he's a good musician. I think it would. He, okay, it that's. Can, can, hello. A drum? That's all he wants? Yeah, sure, we'll get him a drum. Hey, sorry, yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Yeah, it's gross. I don't want him to do it anymore. Okay, yeah, I don't... No, I, I do not either. This guy looks suspicious. Hey, let us talk to you. Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? Shh, hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I Found him. You. But Blordo can. Mention my name. Michael Taint. Michael Taint? But no cracks about my name. Well, sure. Yeah, I don't really have any moral issue okay. accepting a bribe. 
It sounds like a win-win, actually. I get money. They'll accept the bribe, bad. apparently. But uh, come to think of it, the G3 will kill me. So uh, how about no? You just said that you would. Holy shit. Wow. You, we actually got something we can use. Okay. Woo that was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Thank you. Let's thank you. Over to and mention Michael Taint. Over to Blardo. Oh, you look like you're hungry for some food. Wink, wink. I can help. Wink, wink, All right, wink. Gordo. We need the hookup on Dr. Giblets. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy Dr. like that. Dr. Giblets, where is he? What? Why? You got a problem with us asking for Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something or beat it. Buster. I think that you know something, sir. Ah, oh, that piece of shit. I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> Look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now okay, I, I, I will definitely not mention your name. See? Was that so fucking hard? You know, we had to talk to a bunch of losers just to get you to open up. Whoa, great sleuthing detectives. That was an S rank interrogation. Hi everyone, this is uh this is the bad TV show. The TV show's not good. Head to the sl S rank, I'll take that, whatever that means. Hey! This person said I could come in whenever I wanted. See? Glad I Wait, what the hell is that? Nothing fun. I can't believe I'm telling you to be careful, but I guess what? Oh, but guess what? <laughs> I kind of care. And be careful. Don't get yourself killed. I will try my best. Is that kid still here? Oh, nobody knows. Could be crazy. You believe this? Like, what am I stuck on? Really? Handle the tour gang. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Dude, this thing is an instant headshot for these freaking things. Ooh, is that a. Where's this big guy? Oh my god, I'm taking so much damage. Okay. These guys don't know who- Ooh, wait, hold on, there's a chest. How do we get over there? These guys don't know who they're messing with. Die, why won't you die? Okay, this guy is a literal bullet sponge. <gasps> I got him. Just die. Is that everybody? Who is? Oh, you are, huh? Okay. <laughs> I was unaware. I've got a perfectly nice time waiting to be used. His head just exploded. All right, who else we got? Is anybody else over here? Hey, you're using me again. Thanks so much. You're welcome. Anytime. Well, not anytime. Depends on the situation. All right, handle the. I, I I don't see any other person over here. I don't see any other gang members in this area. Oh, there we go. Yeah, nobody's gonna miss you. 
That's <laughs> like my, that's still my favorite thing that he says. Stepped on your ass. He stepped on your ass. We must be on the right trail if they're coming at us this hard. Come on, let, let's get to this high on life place. Grab that chest later. Wait, was he trying to surrender and I just killed him? Oops. Bye bye. I don't need your time bubble. Shut up. There we fucking go. We made it to high on life. I've got 20 of them all. Hello everybody. Trust rules do not apply to the law. Oh, I just hope they don't make me buy a new adapter. Investigate. Welcome to High on Life number 7923. Your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no trip. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Yes, you've introduced yourself 45 times. Yeah, you already know what I'm going to say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Yeah, no shit, Pseudo. Yeah, see, exactly. You told us that so many times. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? No. Oh, man, this again. Look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. Uh, he I seems legit. Know, right? Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. What? I told you. I have no idea where he is. I don't trust he's this guy. Aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now. I don't You're trust this guy at all. Hell out of me. Okay, shit, not not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit a, hit a dead end. So let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. It's all done now. We can investigate more people. Uh, uh, hello, hello, and welcome, welcome to High on Life. I'm Derek. Uh, I'm gonna be a personal uh, High on Life uh, pro professional today. Are you um, okay, sir? That makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm I'm new here. Hey, hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Doctor Giblets around here? Is Why is that? Not to talk about him. God, I'd really love to help you because you look very cool. But no, thank so, you, sir. I, I have no clue. Okay, he doesn't know. That guy doesn't know. What about you? It's my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. He Are looks... helped already? You know, I can't recall whether or not I've heard that name before. But I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous features that come packed... Does anyone know anything? ...and new Hyperbong 6. Oh, I'm so excited you asked. I bet you are. Is a device used to absorb the life energy of another species in order to trigger a psychedelic effect in the operator. That was not interesting to me at all. Okay, someone has to know something. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? We actually prefer not to call it the slum. That's what it is. It's an exciting new up and coming part of town that we hope will attract a youthful new demographic. God, they sell like... money on quality products. Speaking of which, can I interest you in a Hyperbong 6? Oh my god, guys, it is one o'clock in the morning. I have to light a morning coffee candle. Just to stay awake. The smell is going to get me energized. Illegal? No, 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 not not at any. That's a little sketchy, my friend. Reading some of our detractors on the internet or watching too many Clug Nugman speeches. Hyperbongs are totally humane and of no harm to anybody except the creatures you smoke in them. <laughs> you smoke creatures in them. Okay, you have not been any help. Neither have you. Neither have you. I want to shoot everyone in here. 
It's telling us to return. Day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where I don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please just fuck off. You got a fresh <laughs> mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, he's only got one Oh, we should kill both of these guys. But we also need to know where this guy is. Dr. Giblets. Got it. We've got this covered. We got this covered. What the hell is that? Oh my god. Get out of my way. Was this guy trampled to death? Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. What is... Squashed. This is what Black Friday used to be. Do you know anything? Oh, you can go ahead and take his bad boots. It's not a problem. I can just take your boots. Obtain the mag boots. Okay. I mean, I'll take them. That's fine. You can totally take those mag boots. Oh, Why sick. Are you like that bounty hunter? He's dead. He's not using them anymore. We need hey, sick moves. Oh, that's dope. I was wondering what these walls are for because they look different than everything else. This is so sick, man. Okay. Almost pushed me off. Okay, we made it up here. And this stupid ass sniper. No one's going to avenge you. Can you leave me alone? You as well. I got important stuff to do. Where is... Where are we supposed to be going? Over there? But this says right here. Now it's telling me over here. Where do you want me to go? Why is it telling me to go over there? It just says return home. Returning back home because we have so far solved nothing. Oh wait. Hello there. You guys again. How are you? They're cool. We are they? You. Hope that don't rustle your jimmy's none. What are you, men in black? Buckos, we're on your side. We like to formally apologize oh, okay. for how we treated you earlier. We didn't we'll listen. Who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. Yeah. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe Clug he's Nugman? He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically... That sounds awful. Dr. John Giblets, PhD. Hey, Clug wants it squashed. Pronto. Dr. John Giblets. The right bounty hunter for Giblets. The job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblets. He's been warping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread. He sounds like a... That way, it sounds like that voice back in like the dig. early mid 2000s that did all the movie trailers. This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over. You know who that is? Okay. 
maybe hypothetically, the name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything Dr. Like Giblets. Happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's let's go talk to Clug. Let's go talk to him. Go to Clug's office. No? You're gonna Welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been a You're welcome, yeah, sir. Real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a <laughs> Hey, Clug. Tense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but Yeah, we've done a lot. The election is really close. And well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with Dr. Giblets? Well, that's yeah, what we're trying to do. We, that's what we want to do, you know, but uh, it's just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data. Right He's going to give us right to him. Not He's going to. Might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa. Even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick the door down, <laughs> burst our way in there, find him, grab him by the neck. Hey, hey, hey. I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, Acquire the map data. Our best. Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. Vamoose, you <laughs> You're doing great work. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thanks for helping our dad. We Wait, love that's our your dad? dad? They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. That explains I a lot. Buzz off. Fine, dear lord. Just trying to help. I go. See? Club saved our ass. He showed us where Giblets is. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. <laughs> Kill Giblets. Use the portal tab on of the bunny to explore previously visited worlds. Portals tab. Where's this guy at? Is that for paradise? So he's in. Oh, right there. Okay, he's in the upper valley. Let's do it. Finding Dr. Giblets. Giblets? Giblets? Same thing, right? Oh, I'm so tired of. I'm, I'm just literally going to run past all these people because I'm so tired of fighting them. The highway is evolving. Just keep it on going. We're literally just gonna run past all of these people. If we can. I feel like you know like those those destiny missions when you're trying to get from one quest to the next and you like you're on your motorbike and you're trying to avoid all the enemies just so you're not sitting there fighting everything. That's how I feel. And that's a very odd comparison. But destiny was huge in my life. At one point. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. How do we get over there? Can I? I can. Nice. Keep it going. This is the correct way. Yes, it is. I will say. I, I, I'm dying. I'm dying. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. What? Holy shit, dude. You're fucked. What? <laughs> A G3 base warped right through here. <laughs> right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well, it shot me. Oh, oh right I love it. Like cut in half. Bet it was Dr. Giblet's base. Oh, God. Dr. Giblets. Oh, that's so sad. No, come on, you're not dead yet. We're still here with you. You'll be fine. No, no, it's my time to go. So sad. Thank you for for staying with me as I die. Oh, just just don't leave. Okay, now I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm 
Rest in peace, fucko. I just wanted to make it quick for him, you know? <laughs> he seemed like he was suffering. Okay, giblets, you sick fuck. Come on out. Where is he? Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Oh. For clues. Fine, let's just get this shit over with. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people. I mean, kill we've killed the plenty of them. Look at you. That's what you're doing. It's literally exactly what I'm doing. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. All right. What else we got? Nothing else is highlighted. Oh, here we go. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted. Where is this there. guy? While he was doing experiments. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. You and got it. Like that, the chase was on. So I'm actually really enjoying this bounty more than the other ones because this one feels like an actual quest. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh, shit. Sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detective. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. All right, scan that. Oh, back to detective mode. It's detective. Ooh, look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't got a few more things. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. You're welcome. These must be old hyperbong prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these Should out. be the last we one. The next thing. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's it's pretty jacked. Up, right? That is pretty jacked yeah, up. It's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was <laughs> fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. <laughs> okay, are we golden? Right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm back in the next door. Wait, where is the next door? Oh, here we go. Alright, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more <laughs> clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Oh my god, this is awesome. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do, so... Okay. Yeah, he was correct on that. Oh no, they look like shit! Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful. Did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows? I that's think so. Out. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Doctor Giblets really did go insane. Please tell me that he, he killed himself. Someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Doctor Giblets okay. and decrypting the password on his security systems. It's all of our. It's all our fault. We point right to him. So you wasted our fucking time, pseudo. Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much. I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. Okay, let's go kill him. Where's he at? Please don't tell me this is like a five part fight. Dr. Oh, wait, that's him right there. That's Dr. Giblets, right? Pretty anticlimactic. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Oh, 
What the fuck are you waiting for? The guy died. So let me come. Oh my god, dude. That is fucking hilarious. What an idiot. What an idiot. There's more to this, isn't there? Is that what I think it is? Oh, this is... I kind of wanted to not have to, like, you know, mix it up and not have to fight. Is this all you guys got? Oh my god! Where did you come from? Is my health gonna come back? Run free, little people. Anything else? If you're still alive to hear this, then I made a great mistake. I was wrong. Only one person could Oh my god. Myself. I killed myself. Finally. It makes sense, you know. I You did kill yourself, you idiot. It was you. Good for me. Oh, that's dark. So, okay, I killed myself. Whoops. My apologies to whoever's hearing this. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all Freaking that. idiot. You can Thank you, I appreciate that. RIP Jimlets. Wow, okay, good, 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 good work. I think we can get back out through the trap door now. Which way? Aha. There we go. Does it open that? Um. Hello? How's it going? We are stuck in here. Um. Let's do this, bounty hunter. We are literally stuck in this room. Oh, were we supposed to get this thing? Look at him just hanging there. I hate to say it, but he might be a goner. Let's take him to Gene and see if he can help. I just wanted to say, you know, today really meant a lot to me. And, um, uh, God, oh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. 
red. You can't see it. <laughs> I thought we were stuck in that room for a second. Oh, look at that. We made it back. Dr. Giblet's all by yourself. Shame. That we did. It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over. Let's bow wow. I don't really want to. Talk, wait, let's talk to this guy. Oh my god, what is happening? Am I glitching out right now? I can't do anything, I'm stuck. One second. Oh wait, there we go. Did we get it fixed? Hold on. Okay, never mind. Not one second. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh shit, that's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think he's dead. But oh, god damn, yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? <laughs> Just tosses him on the Do you table. Think he's salvageable, buddy. I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes. I can definitely fix it. Okay, th okay. Thanks, you finally have some use. You know, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be. Uh... What was that? Uh, nothing. I, 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 I was being shitty. You didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but uh... turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. What's the bad news? Okay, come on over. Let me give you the news. All right, what do you got? Okay, first? what you got for us? Which do you want first? The bad news. news. Or the bad news? All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. Of course she has. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her, but... Uh, Same. You know, you, you might want to look into it since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. <laughs> a Space Applebee's. <laughs> of course, that's where that he works. Lie, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Okay, uh, all right, I was well. To pull a fast one on you, and I failed. So, uh, it's pretty embarrassing. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh. I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlian you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite, uh, you and I, our best pals. <laughs> yes, we can do that. How do we leave the other guns? Okay, well... Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching. Okay, I appreciate. Oh, okay, hold on. He wants to talk, apparently. How do I set them down? There you go. Oh, sure. We can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. <laughs> we'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's and we're, let's find your sister. Okay, now. Now we're done. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, it is like 2 o'clock in the morning, so I have got to get off. Um, we're just going to keep doing bounties and kind of like one thing at a time so we don't get too carried away here. But, um... That's about it. Did I say Wade? So we don't get too carried away is what I meant to say. But thank you guys so much for watching. Again, 2 o'clock in the morning. I am tired. My eyes are heavy. I cannot think straight. So until the next one, peace out.